Look at this old bastard over here. He's just sitting there. I went in there to get some tacos, come out, and he's just sitting there, glued to his phone, handicaps, sticker, and everything. They get these really old fuckers to do this shit. They eat this shit up. Just staring at their fucking phones. What are they what are they looking at out there? I mean, you know, it just makes you wonder. But I uh I was just thinking recently, like, um, uh, you know, like, I don't think it's a hundred percent like this, but, uh, I do think there's some aspects of, uh, alien technology that they use against us. Um, because all this technology that they, they have access to, and now look at this, look at this car, look at this car right here, September 2nd. And it's October 5th. Um, all this act, this technology they have access to is like really advanced. And it makes you wonder like, you know, what all, what all they're using, you know? Um, and you wonder why sometimes people are like walking around looking all like robotic and shit. And acting almost like aliens and it kind of makes you wonder like are we living amongst robots and AI artificial intelligence and I mean are there aliens dis disguised as humans you know acting like us to try to like be like us kind of like you know invasion of the body snatchers type shit or is it like are they like alien hybrids maybe you know, like, uh, part alien, part human. And it's almost like the more this technology that we use, um, the more advanced it gets, it's like, it's almost like it, it, it infects, it affects people itself and makes them more robotic. You know, like, why do so many people look like they're robots? It's because the more technology we use, the more the AI and the robots are infecting us, making us like this, because I saw something similar to this, uh, I don't know if you've seen the recent uh, season of Westworld, but basically, spoiler alert, in the latest season, um, the robots, the AI, artificial intelligence, they take over, and they are like the new humans, and humans are subservient to them and they basically control humans by using these little um, robot flies that go inside their like ears and they go up in their brain and they kind of like just overtake them and I swear it's so similar to the shit you see now and it's like there's so many like parallels to it to the similarities that have that, that you know we see happening on a day-to-day -day basis that it's like you makes you wonder like are damn like robots influencing us? Are aliens influencing us? Are they either taking us over? Or are they completely like taking over um, artificial intelligence, like disguises humans full on, like just coming, walking around us? Like, are they really like robots disguised as humans? Or is it just some kind of like way the AI is controlling humans now? Just like, is it totally like aliens now that we see people like coming, that we see, you know, uh, walking around us, looking just as unusual as you would think they would be if they were like an AI, you know? Or is it some kind of like hybrid situation where, you know, some of the uh, aliens have maybe crossed with humans and made some half-breed, you know, human and... <clears throat> alien babies i mean i'm just saying i don't 100 percent think any of this shit's true but it's like ever since all this shit's been going on with the shit that i've been noticing i mean it makes you wonder if it is because i mean this shit is just so out there and it's just so it's like every fucking thing you've seen in sci-fi movies grown up and it makes you wonder like is this shit real because i'm telling you with all the shit they have now and Area 51 and all these 
I mean, was, there's another one. Area 52, I think, is in Utah. All these are highly guarded, highly secured areas. Why do you think that is? I mean, they have to have access to this technology that they don't want others to have access to. Even the president can't get access to this. And why is that? That's because I strongly believe that they're using, they're harvesting this technology, and they have been since the 40s, since Area 51 started, and they're they're trying to, you know, study from all of the different, you know, life forms that they've taken and they've studied at Area 51 and they're using that against us. And only the top secret, top level people have access to it. But they're obviously giving some of very limited access or information to the people that participate in this uh, gang stalking, group stalking stuff. Of course, they don't have all of this information at the palm of their hands, but the people that are controlling them, they're telling them what to do. Some of them, if not all, most, I'm sure, do have access to this technology. And, um, you know, I mean, it's pretty clear that there's some kind of shit that's really far advanced that can uh, pick up on mind reading and your thoughts and what you're doing because... There's too many times that you go to certain areas and there's just all these people that are just there waiting for you. And, you know, so many times I've said, oh, they just scatter these people all over the place. You know, they just have them waiting at every different checkpoint, every different corner. But I really don't think that's the case. I really think that they have this uh, mind reading technology that they use uh, that could be either just advanced technology that the government's used over the years or that they harvested from alien technology, which I strongly believe it is alien technology. Um, and, you know, I've seen a few uh, UFOs, whatever they call them now. I mean, I don't always necessarily think that that's aliens driving these things. I mean, it could be humans, but I have seen several um, several thing, things that were... Uh, it appears to be uh, a UFO and it doesn't look like anything like a normal plane or helicopter or anything like that. <clears throat> and, um, and you got Congress looking into all this shit now they never had before trying to pass bills to, you know, look into UFOs and shit. And I mean, why would they be doing that unless there is some truth to this? I mean, I've always believed that there are UFOs out there. I always have. I've not never been the one to believe like every thing you see on TV is a UFO, but, or all these videos you see are UFOs, but I believe that it is, it does exist, and Area 51 is uh, secretly and very secure for a reason, there's reasons why even the president doesn't know about uh, shit like that, so, uh, yeah, there's some kind of, there's, there's some kind of technology they have that, you know, um, even the people they employ, even the gang stalking uh, people that do this don't even know about, you know, they just, they, their handlers have access to it, and I'm telling you, there's some type of mind reading or something that's, I don't know if it's something seeing into the future or what, that they have adopted from alien life form, and I would never have been the one in a million years to ever say that or think that, but it's the only thing that makes sense now, you know, it really is, after really being open and, and knowing, uh, what this shit is now for, um, over a year, you start to kind of, you know, just collect notes and think, and things in your head and think, this doesn't make sense, this doesn't seem right, this can only be this, you know, and when you're not, when you don't know what's going on, and when you don't know you're going through this, and you just think everything's coincidence, then yeah, you just block it all out. But once you realize what's going on, you realize that, hey, this is something way more advanced than any human could ever encounter. And who knows, maybe everything that, every te all this technology that has been really uh, booming since the 40s, really, maybe this is all has been alien ever, ever since, uh, you know, Every smartphones, maybe this is alien technology. Maybe every single thing we do is alien technology for all we know. But there are definitely some aspects of this that is not human, that is definitely from another world, some type of technology they're using against us because it's, it's far too advanced. 
So I just wanted to give my two cents on that because, yeah, I, I, I observe a lot of shit. I've been observing a lot of shit for a long time, and something's not adding up. It's not adding up. So uh, keep your head up and just be alert and uh, just know that there's something strange going on out there. All right. I'll talk to you later.